New print materials may cost low quality of 3D prints. There are a lot of things to consider to get the right temperature of the print materials used in 3D printing. It varies based on the environment, room temperature, and the nozzle size that you'll be using. And there are instances that the right temperature of the print materials varies on their brand, or what kind of print materials you'll be using. That is why it is needed to test extrude first and know the correct temperature for your print materials to achieve a good quality 3D print. This tutorial will teach you on how to get the right temperature of the print material to achieve a great 3D print. Open the 3D Creator software and connect it to the printer. Then, set the temperature to 150 degrees and wait until the set temperature is reached. Hold and press the extruder lever to have an opening to the nozzle mechanism. Then, insert the print material into the nozzle mechanism. Push it through until it manually extrudes from the nozzle. If the print material does not extrude from the nozzle, it means that it is not the proper temperature for the material. You have then to increase the temperature of the nozzle by 10 degrees again. Push through the print material until it manually extrudes from the nozzle. Repeat the process until the nozzle successfully extrude the print material manually. This means that you have successfully reached the right temperature for your print material. You are now set to create a super 3D print. Let's try printing an object using different nozzle temperature to see the effect of varying nozzle temperature to the print quality. When you set the temperature to 165 degrees Celsius, there might be an inconsistency in extruding the filament and may cause breakage of the filament extruded. It means that the 165 degrees Celsius is not yet the right temperature to get the proper print quality. When you set the temperature to 185 degrees Celsius, it is now the right temperature for the print material and there will be no failing filament during printing the bridge of the DNA object. Lastly, if you set a higher temperature, you may start seeing fibers or excess filament in the object, which is also not good in getting the right print quality for the 3D object. In 3D printing, 
it is important to understand that the nozzle temperature is inversely proportional to the size of the nozzle tip. It means that when the size of the nozzle tip is small, high temperature for the print material is required to melt it.